Hi guys, it's David again. It is so cold out here today. I'm here in Dayton, of course, Dayton, Ohio, but uh, it's so cold out here today that um, they even put down a different mixture on the uh, roads because that blue stuff, they don't normally put that stuff down. Normally they just put down regular salt, but that's how cold it is because they had to actually put down a whole different mixture today uh, to make sure that the uh, streets are still going to be able to be uh, clean and um, keep the ice off the streets and stuff like that. But uh, to tell you how cold it is too, it's um, it's like zero degrees out right now because I called the temperature earlier. It might even be uh, cold, colder than that actually because I called about an hour ago, and um, they were saying that it's supposed to get up to, or I'm sorry, it's supposed to get to uh, minus 10 degrees by five o'clock this afternoon, and uh, so that's telling you how cold it is. And then tomorrow it's supposed to even well to, at least um, uh, uh, to, well tonight anyways is what I should say. It's supposed to get down to like 13 degrees below zero. And then with the wind chills, they was talking about maybe about uh, 30 degrees below zero is what it's going to feel like as, as far as with the wind chills and stuff too. So that's crazy how cold it's been. I think it was saying that it hasn't been this cold, uh, especially in this area anyways, for about 20 years. That's how long it's been, and that's that's telling you how cold it is right now then too, and how cold it's, it's going to be tomorrow too as well. But it's just it's just crazy how how cold it is. It's insane. But uh, one thing that actually did shock me though too is the library is actually open today. I don't know why they are because you would think that if all the schools would be closed that the library would be uh, closed as well too. Because in fact even Dayton Public Schools are closed today and they seem to never close. In fact I remember when I was growing up and that's the schools I went to, uh, it seemed like it could be the end of the world and they would still be open no matter what. So that's insane that even they're closed today too. Of course, even last night, there was a whole lot of schools and a whole lot of places that was even showing that it was going to be closed even last night before um, anything was really going down too much. I mean, of course, it was snowing last night, too, but I think we only got like a few inches. We actually dodged the bullet because up north, um, up in like Mercer County, Mercer County, which I think is, um, I don't know, it's probably like less than 100 miles from here, probably not too far anyways, uh, up north I think is where it's at. But anyways, um, they got like six inches of snow last night, I think. No, actually, I think it was eight inches, come to think about it. They got like eight inches of snow last night, so that's just crazy. It's like a blizzard that hit us all of a sudden. And uh, what's even more crazy is that uh, next weekend, though, it's going to get up to the 40s and 50s. In fact, I think uh, Saturday is supposed to be in the 40s, and then uh, Sunday, I think, it's supposed to get into the 50s. And so that's crazy because it's going to feel like a heat wave compared to what we've got right now, what we've been dealing with within this past week or so. That's just insane. But I'm glad the library is open today because that way I can go to the library and get online and get on my YouTube account and check out some more videos and stuff like that. So <clears throat> for the guys that I am subscribed to, just keep on uh, coming with it. Excuse me, keep on coming with the videos. And I'm going to keep on checking them out as much as I can. Uh, also, too, to give you like another like a slight update. What I had decided to recently do is to go ahead and start uh, doing some eBay auctions because uh, like I've talked about in my other videos, uh, doing internet marketing and working online is what I really want to do. That's like what my passion actually is and um, I'd rather of course be doing that than be working a regular job. That way to have more freedom and stuff. So um, I'm going to start posting some auctions. So also too, if there's anything that you guys uh, are in need of that you would normally order, especially from eBay then uh, go ahead and let me know because I might be able to go ahead and post the auction up for you and that way you can get the item from me instead. Uh, so just make sure you remember that as far as if there's anything that you need. But um, yeah, uh, what else was I going to talk about real quick? Oh yeah, as far as job situation, I am actually still going to put out some applications for uh, some part for a part-time job. But you know, that's the thing is I'm not concerned about working full-time because I want to do the online thing as well for sure I want to definitely get that going as much as I can and get that going in full force because you know of course my first step was to get the van and to make sure I'm getting supplies and stuff inside the van that I need so that was the first step and then the second step is going to be make sure I'm able to start working online because you know that's what I really want to do and I want to be able to have the freedom to you know work for myself and to be able to have uh, some free time as well and you know, do the things I want to do as far as my own schedule. So, in other words, if I want to go out sometime with the van and, you know, go exploring or go driving around or whatever, you know, I want to be able to have that type of option. But if I'm stuck to a full-time job, then I'm not going to have that type of option. 
So as far as right now, I'm, I might still, like I said, go ahead and check out a part-time job. But also, too, that even depends on how fast I get this thing going as far as the online thing I want to do and how much money I want to end up making from it, though, because, you know, I want to try to get that going as quick as I can. And if I can start making even like four or five hundred dollars a month uh, pretty soon from it, then that's going to be a good thing because that's going to allow me to have some money to pay some bills that I've, that I've got right now and to still be able to uh, not have to worry about a job and then be able to, um, you know, do my own thing. In other words, be able to be free and go out exploring with the van and go out and do some stuff I want to be able to do. If you, you, in other words, even if I'm just making like four or five hundred dollars a month from, um, from doing my online stuff, though. As far as the eBay thing, that's just one thing I'm going to be working on. There is other things I'm going to later on try to get going again too, as far as making money online, because there's tons, of course, there's of course tons of ways of making money online, and um, so the eBay thing is just one thing though I want to get into. But yeah, I think that's about it too, as far as um, updates and just giving you guys a quick, you know, tidbit as far as what's going on today and stuff. If you guys got any questions or concerns, let me know, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And again, of course, thanks for watching. My videos and um, make sure you subscribe if you haven't already done so and um, that's it so thanks and you guys have a great day